hello and welcome to the video tutorial this video I'll be teaching you how to create a peeling sticker like this one in Adobe Photoshop CS4 5 or 3 or whatever version you want to use so this is pretty simple to create I used a couple of layers just to create this effect <coughs> but it's not uh, so much difficult I've seen so many videos they are like killing how to create in fireworks and illustrator but till now I've seen uh, I've not seen so many videos they are like showing <coughs> this one in Photoshop so I'm gonna show you go to the file create a new document in this I'm gonna make by thousand by thousand and here my resolutions are 72 name peeling sticker <coughs> 8 bit and white so I'm gonna say it okay and it's gonna create something like this now I'm gonna double click my background layer if you don't have the layers palette go to the window click layers or you can for the shortcut you can press F7 now I'm gonna double click my background layer and I'm just gonna name this uh, background again because this is gonna be our background and we want uh, some gradient to be our background so I'm gonna go to the blending options and first of all give it a pattern and give it a pattern like this I uh, just just go through just check all the patterns you want <coughs> you can select any of the background you want but Make sure it look good. Otherwise, your sticker will not uh, your sticker will not look good as mine or better than mine. So click on the gradient over there right now, and we're gonna make one gradient of brown color. First of all, light brown, and then the dark brown. So, I'm gonna hit OK and I'm just gonna decrease the opacity over there and click reverse. <coughs> so, there you go. Okay, so I'm just gonna hit OK again and we'll get something like this. Now, take the our ellipse tool or press Shift and U three times. press a shift and you three times and you, you'll get the ellipse tool <coughs> and make one uh, round shape this is black right now because we're gonna fill gradient in it and go to the blending options of this shape <coughs> gradient overlay in this gradient overlay as I used was blue, blue color now I'm just gonna make it somewhere like blue and the second one do the dark blue one so okay and go to the stroke now and I'm gonna put the stroke of 28 pixels or 20 pixels enough and I'm gonna change the color to white and click OK there and you'll get something like this <coughs> now OK because our shape has some effects I want to remove these effects I'm not gonna remove but I'm gonna make this layer merge with a new layer create a new layer just don't give it any effect press control and select both of these layers click merge layers you see our effects are gone now we're gonna cut some part from here I'm gonna take my plugin and lasso tool and just cut one part from here uh, done or just put it some or area yeah Okay, so I'm gonna go to the edit, cut, see, cut it. 
Now again go to the edit paste. Our the part we cut it is over here. <coughs> now if you just want to make it clean back, you can press Control Z. But now if you're gonna press Control T, make it upside down. Yeah, this is pretty good. <coughs> what I wanted. And now we're gonna make a new layer again. Take the brush tool, put one black color over here, decrease the opacity, just drag it down. And just decrease opacity one more time. <coughs> now we're gonna give some drop shadow over here so it looks our sticker is peeled. Go to the blending options, uh the part we cut it click on the drop shadow you can see the drop shadow over here but if you're gonna change the angle yeah there you go give it all this color and this is pretty good now give it a text of your choice text I'm gonna name this photo shop make the size big or small if you want or something like this and you'll get something like this so this is our peeling sticker tutorial you can download the BSD format also and thanks for watching this video hope you like it make sure you rate comment and subscribe